Today I'm going to attempt to swap these cylinder sleeves and cylinder blocks. All I'm going to use is heat, force, scrap wood, and penetrating oil. I'm trying this because my engine had low compression and the cylinder and piston measured out of spec. I found this low miles cylinder with a matching piston on eBay so I figured I would just swap it out with mine. The only problem was there was a few differences with the blocks. These two bolt holes didn't measure up and there's some differences like here and here and the sides and here and here but the sleeves measured up the same so I figured I would try and swap them first I applied some penetrating oil to the bottom and top of each sleeve I'm not really sure if this will do anything but I figured it couldn't hurt I let them sit for about an hour and then I preheated my oven to 350 degrees. I put the cylinder in for about 15 minutes and soon enough I had a hot hunk of metal and my kitchen reeked of PB Blaster. And don't forget to put some gloves on for this, it comes out pretty hot. So first I flip the cylinder upside down, put some wood blocks under it, clear of the sleeve and I gave it some good wax with a mallet and it actually broke free pretty easily and it slid about halfway down until it got hung up and I had envisioned making this clamp setup where I push it out and it didn't really work at all I ended up actually cutting some 2x4s and making a square to fit around the sleeve and I just continued knocking it from the bottom I tried hitting it first with some wood but it just splintered apart so I eventually used some rebar and I carefully hit around the circumference of the sleeve making sure not to mar the inside of the cylinder. I repeated the process for the second cylinder and it came out just as easily. I actually didn't get video of me inserting the good sleeve into the correct cylinder. I think what happened was that the cylinder block was still hot and the sleeve had cooled down and it just slid right in without resistance. I didn't really need the other sleeve installed into the other block, but I decided to give it a try anyway. So I preheated the oven and I inserted the sleeve into the freezer for about an hour or so. When it came out, I just applied some oil to the outside of the sleeve and the inside of the cylinder and it went right together. I didn't even have to hit it with a mallet or anything. I was pretty surprised with how well this went. I'd say that it could be an alternative to boring out and getting a new piston if you're on a budget. I don't think I'd try this if I was very worried about damaging my parts. I didn't really have anything to lose here because I was just going to have to bore out if this didn't work. I won't know if this was truly a success until I reassemble the engine and give it a kick.